All right, so came back to this guy just for the hell of it to tell him another agent's coming. Uh, tell him another another agent. He's coming. Want me to stand guard until he get? <laughs> yes, thanks. Bye. Okay, good. Now we can go up here. Nice. All right, so let's go up here. See what the hell's going on with the president. Why? See why he's hanging out with that uh, robot guy. You got some explaining to do, Mr. President. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Charge. Really? All right. Like, Here we go. you're doing that twice? <laughs> that's pretty shitty. Like, that's a pretty, like, blatant... Oh, man. Never doubted you for a like, it just feels like they're trying to drag the game out longer. They're, like, wanting to be longer. It doesn't really need to be longer. It's already pretty long, that's what she said. Like, why on earth do you feel like you need to drag the game out more? Like, so now I have to run all the way back and find another agent somewhere. <sighs> Let me see if I can find one. All right, so remember this area where I had the broken bridge and I was like, oh, there's no way to get over there. Well, I was I was looking at the map because I was like, all right, I'm pretty sure this is probably the agent. So I look, there's like a little path right here that goes down and you can go under the bridge. Again, I, I just don't, what's the point of doing that? Like, I don't know. But a breathtaking view. Didn't you start your shift a while ago? Yes, I was hoping no one would notice. Go back to work. All right. So now I shall go back again and uh, talk to the other agent. All right, so here we go. Talk to another agent, he's coming. We'll stand, yeah. <laughs> Even it's the same dialogue, it's like, Jesus. I was like, are they just going to stand there? I was like, nope, they're going to attack. Uh, go ahead. I've got your back, bro. Probably better to just attack one enemy. But yeah, sometimes... Well, I was going to... Never mind. Forget it. I was going to say something about her area attack does very little damage. But um, I forgot she... Uh, that's based on another stat, so... Makes sense. So ignore that. All right, so let's Another blow away these guys. And let's go talk to the president and find out what the Mr. hell's president, going on. We found you. Fantastic. Though I didn't know I was lost. I've been having a wonderful time on vacation. And we just win the presidency? Vacation? Sir, the world is going down the drain as we speak. It's raining cats and dogs. It has? That sounds borderline serious. Why has my staff told me to relax and enjoy myself? You aren't on vacation, sir. I think you're a prisoner here. Impossible! I could leave any time I like. President is fine, like little bear. You will leave now. I <laughs> think he says you will. Huh? Who's this guy? Oh, this is Agent Doom, my new bodyguard. Pretty high tech, huh? <laughs> he just kind of showed up. I am head of security. I rip off intruder's arms. So, that means you'll be ripping your own arms off, right? Not today. Now is time to kill you. You think that might make the president a little suspicious? Here we go. All right. Let's go ahead and do time lapse because he'll probably actually live for a little bit. Uh, let's try that, and we're gonna Charlie horse him. Ooh, resistant to physical, eh? That could be a little annoying. How do you fancy this? Hell yeah, that'll teach him. Good job. So we're gonna do time lapse again, and let's see. Give uh, give her a random buff, cause well, give him him, cause he's the one who does a lot of damage. Nice. And reboots his personality OS. Wait, what? Did it only do two damage, or was that her? I get to watch that this time. I've got your back, bro. Sixty-two. Oh, there we go. I leave now to take care of other plans. We will meet again. <laughs> Whoa! What in the hell? Mega mole? I couldn't see what the text was. What the deuce? Uh, so wait, maybe we, I don't know if we can actually kill him before he uh, 
goes under. Probably not, but try to stop him. Probably not going to happen. Uh, he's weak to poison, though. Uh, go ahead and roughhouse him. Damn, son. What the fuck? Nice. Effective. Go ahead and do another physical attack. Go ahead and look, try that. Charlie horse. Oh, god. Okay, damn it. You got this. Uh, just throw the poison down the hole. Yeah, ah. Does he have to stay down there? Jackasses. I think Ooh. I've wilted. Rip in peace. Let's try time lapse again, even though I don't think it's gonna matter. Damn, 76 on the first time lapse. How much is this one gonna do? 119, nice. Get wrecked, mole thing. Yeah, this is gonna do it. <laughs> That's exactly what a mole sounds like when it dies. Actually, I have obviously no idea. Come on, gardener. Now do you believe us, Mr. President? That bodyguard was an imposter. And a giant mole with a drill on his nose. Well, thank goodness you showed up when you did. You're clearly better at this sort of stuff than I am. It's almost like I should be president. You're planning on staying here, aren't you? Sir, the people of Earth need their president. Part of being a good leader is knowing how to delegate these lesser tasks. I didn't get to where I am today by micromanaging. I think you'll do just fine. Ha! <laughs> oh. well, at least he's safe for now. Yes, and I've come to a conclusion. It's time for me to delegate as well. I leave you all in charge of this problem while I go and relax for a bit. Uh-uh. Nope, you don't get off the hook that easy. Fine, but after we save the world, I need a day at the spa. You think we've straightened everything nice. up now? Hmm. It's possible. All this helping people really seems to be making an impact. Uh huh. I agree. Maybe we should go check on the hippies in Sugar Flats. Do we have to? Nice. All right, Chapter Four: Return to the Hippie Guru. All right. Well, I'm gonna head that way. Oh, after she levels up. Nice. Yes, become even more powerful photographer. Even more powerful than... <laughs> yeah, you better run. He's like, oh shit, no, never mind. I don't want none of that. Oh, hey. What's over here? Bring in the bodyguard. And I... Uh, will... <laughs> Sorry. Alright. Let's... Bring in... Her... Knock on the porta potty, nobody's there. Good thing, too, because they would have been stuck. Donut. 500 bucks. Uh, Alright, whatevs. Uh, is there anything else down here? Nope. Alright, so let's look at our agenda. Actually, wait, now it's what we want. Bad juju. Oh, okay, we still. Okay. Alright, this. I'm going to. Actually, you know what? Her taking me to Sugar Flats takes me to that area that I can't get down. So I'll just get to the hippie guru and I'll see you guys then. Alright, I guess I want to show you that. This is in the Sugar Flats. This is where you fly in. Or not even the Sugar Flats. This is the Forbidden Desert. This behind that uh, big uh, weight thing. So now he was high enough level to get it. Getting some decent things. Money. That's a lot of money, to be fair. Yeah, and I actually did take the flight back to, to Sugar Flats. And yeah, just like I suspected, it was, uh, there's no way to get down. And it looks like this is the same, same deal here, where they, like, put you somewhere that you can't get down. Unless we can do it here? No? Like, why? Why would you do that? Like, it just, like, why? Running back is not fun at all. Like, I don't get it. But let's use some of these brain juices. Where are they? It's going to be here. What are these? Give some XP to an ally. It'd probably be somebody relatively random here. Let's go ahead and give it to the bug girl. Special blend. 
No one knows what this stuff is capable of. I'm just gonna keep giving it to her. Is she actually making a drinking sound? I, I think so. God damn it, stop switching that off. Lots of XP. Again, it doesn't really matter because even if there is like a character later, I'm like, oh wait, shit, I need XP. We know how to abuse the hell out of it now. Wow, well, she's actually pretty high. I didn't realize that. Let's go ahead and give it to. Oops, let's go ahead and give it to somebody else. Um, let's give the brain nectar to. Let's give it to the gardener. I'm feeling better already. I'm feeling better. Oh wow! I'm feeling Holy better shit! God damn! Whoa! How much experience did they give her? Holy shit! Wow! Uh, God damn it, stop doing that. I don't know why it's doing that. Um. Let's give some to mom in case I decide to bring her along. Yeah. <laughs> mother knows, mother knows, mother knows best. Okay, oh, damn it, stop doing that. I don't know why it's doing that. I don't, I don't think I'm double clicking. Um, let's give it to her. Yay. Damn. Oh, god damn. So is it giving an effect fixed amount or like a percentage of XP? If it's a percentage, then it's like insanely good. Anyway, let's switch them back with the gardener, yeah. just so I can get her max level. And uh, again, I'll get you when I get the uh, guru hippie. All right, let's start with the guru. You have returned. Of course, and the world is now 100% safe and sound. Well, not so much. Hmm? Yeah, we still gotta get to the Moonbucks crash site, remember? Well, excuse me for thinking the cup's half full. There is still cause to rejoice. The artifact has returned to its former warmth and serenity. Doesn't seem like it. Those people are still pretty pissed off outside. Perhaps you might bring it with you as an offering to these moon people. It's not an alien ship. It's a coffee shop that... <sighs> Forget it. Sure, sounds like a good idea. Now let's find a way into the desert. Hmm? How do we do that? Two words for you. Secretary. That guy is like a wandering almanac of useless information. Granted, in this case, it's kind of useful information. The Earth is lucky to have you looking out for her interests, Star Brother. Nice. Completed chapter four. Retrieve the artifact that the guru mentioned. All right. Now we should find out where that is. So I guess we have to go to the secretary and ask him. Yes, hold on. I found out if you go to the map too quickly before it loads, it uh, you you have it, like the things won't be identified. Kind of annoying. But uh, anyway, I guess I've got to go back to the secretary now. But I guess I'll see you guys when I find him. All right, here it is. I think this artifact. This is the artifact the guru mentioned. Wonder what it does. But we should take it with us and see what happens. You think it's safe to touch? Someone grab it. You found the mysterious artifact. Talk to your secretary. Okay, now I'm supposed to go back. Shit. Alright. This might be pretty quick. I think. If we go to Capital City. I think he's in this version of the White House. Yeah, here we go. Just gotta get up to him. Uh, or at least this place is a map. Thank Christ. I would have gotten lost so many times. Ah, he's in here. Good. Yes, what is? Do you need something? Hmm. The leader of the hippies thinks we need to head to Wellspring Desert to find the moon bucks. Huh? So you're listening to the hippies now, eh? Uh -uh. He's not any old hippie, he's their guru. Uh -huh. Ah yes, well the word justifies so very much. Hmm? So how do we how do we get to the desert? Hmm. Well that's going to be tricky. Uh -huh. Firstly, the Forbidden Highway will take you there, but there's a sandstorm. Hmm. We need someone who can control weather. Uh -huh. 
Or instead, you could go there by sea. There's a dock by the south side of the desert. Finally, there's been talk of a drive-in moviegoers mysteriously being teleported to the desert. The last option sounds like tabloid nonsense, though. Whoa. That's a lot of options. Forbidden Highway, by sea, or drive-in movie magic. All right. So, I guess basically we talked to him to find out what we already know. And we'll probably go to the Hor Forbidden Highway. That's probably going to be quicker. So, um, <laughs> I can't teleport there because... Uh, it takes you to nowhere, but anyway, I'll get through there and I'll see you the next step of this quest. Arg! Oh. The sandstorm's too powerful. Alright, let's get the weather lady. You know, if the weather people can actually predict the weather, or can, you know, control the weather, then why are they so bad at predicting it? Actually, I guess they're that bad. Whoa. Oh. oh, okay. I thought she was just gonna do it automatically. Alright, that's fine. And just have her change the weather over. Don't like the wet. Let's go with rain. That sounds nice. I'm gonna switch her out. Yeah. There we go. Ah, this is much better traveling weather. Right. Weather lady to the rescue. Yeah. Thanks, hon. Anytime. Wack, 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 wack. Let's roll. I like this desert. Some of the music in this game is pretty good. Obviously, hometown music is addictive as hell. But, uh... The Forbidden Desert area is pretty good. I didn't think there was a sandstorm there before. I don't think. Alright. We still need to keep going through. I don't know. We made it! Looks like we made it. Oh. I'm so thirsty. I could really go for a mirage right about now. Hmm? I really need to be hallucinating. We barely got here. Hmm. Maybe there'll still be there'll be there'll still be coffee in the moon bucks. Find a way to the moon bucks. 